The person I've chosen is actress Chelsea Healy. Chelsea has appeared in Waterloo Road and Hollyoaks, but today she's not playing a part, she's being herself. Someone got one over on me, I'd be kind of fuming and I wouldn't be able to control my actions. <laughs> I've already written the script for what I think is going to happen today. My job will be to control their thoughts to the point that they do everything that's in that script, even though they've never seen it before. Chelsea perfected her Paso Doble in Strictly Come Dancing, but fancy footwork won't cut it here. This is all about mental agility. To be honest, I doubt that he's going to get one over on me, and I'm a very clever and smart girl, so I'll spot it a mile off. The real Chelsea is tougher than any character she's played on TV. This could be tricky. Chelsea, thank you so much for coming. I can't thank you enough. And I know you're a bit tired. Uh, you're just <laughs> off a flight. Where have you been? Um, I've been to a Ibiza. Oh, brilliant, you lucky duck. <laughs> um, you're the type of actress that really takes on a role and gets inside to the point where you feel like you are the character as opposed to just playing the character sometimes. And I wanted to try something along that control theme. So all we're going to do, first of all, is play a guessing game. And it's important that before we do this that we double check. You have no idea what's about to happen. I I haven't a clue, OK, no. good, good. Well, I'm going to uh, take my watch and I'm going to set it to um, a time, a time that isn't the time right now, all right? So what time do you have there? Um, I'm not sure whether this is still on a beef for time. OK, that's all right. 22.4. Let me see your watch. It just says party. OK, all right, <laughs> so but I want you to imagine for a moment that you can see an hour hand spinning around on a clock. What number, what hour does that hour hand stop on? Three. Now I want you to imagine the minute hand is spinning around. So this is how many minutes past three we're thinking about, all right? So what is the time that you're thinking of? Three thirty. That was a random choice? Yeah. Did you feel controlled? No. Do you want to take a look at the time? <laughs> oh, my. 3.30? Oh, oh my gosh, no! <laughs> I'm going to try um, one more thing with yeah, you. Um, okay. And I want to say right now, from the very start, that um, I've got something for you here. So Thank your you so job much. is to make sure that I, I don't take that off your... In okay. fact, you can put your hand on it for me. Um, so I want you to imagine now that um, maybe I've written a script for you. And in that script, you're going somewhere in the world, to a country, a country that I couldn't possibly know, a secret country, and that just feels right right now. OK. So... Where was it that you wanted to travel to? What country? Marbella. Marbella, OK. Marbella. Have you ever been to Marbella before? Yes. All right. Did you like it? I loved it. OK. So let's try something else now. This time, I want you to, in your head, I want you to yeah. think of a date, OK? Um, a date that um, it can either be a random date, any point in the future or in the past. Uh, whenever you're ready, um, what's your date? Six of the eight. 1988. Is that, a, is that a random, really random one, or does it mean something to it you? It means something. By the way, these are popping into your head? Yeah. Uh, OK. Uh, this time, think of um, a celebrity. Any celebrity in the world. It can be someone that you know, someone that you don't know. It can be a stranger, someone that you've met, someone that's a great friend. Whenever you're ready, go ahead and name the person that you're thinking of. Dapper. Dapper? From Endos? Um, do you know it hasn't? It hasn't quite. Uh, it hasn't quite. But look, thank okay. you so much. You've been really, really. Br okay. I promise you, it's my fault, not Are yours. You sure? I, no, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank oh, but, um, but you should probably. You can open it up there. I don't want you to break your nails. Though we're not insured. No, I won't. I they look like they cost the price of my house. Thank <laughs> you Oh, you're okay. Not at all. Um, I should probably be a bit more honest with you now. This isn't a voucher. This is a script that I'd written six weeks ago for today. Oh. Um, could, you, um, could you go ahead and read it out loud for me? David and Chelsea are sitting at a table beside some clocks. Chelsea is, like, totally amazed and really, really blown away by how, <laughs> how awesome David okay, is. OK, it's kind of awkward, but never mind. No, it's true. She continues reading from the script, which has been in an envelope, which she has said the whole time. David is going to control my thoughts and make me think of Marbella. The... Oh, my God! Oh, I've got all makeup on this paper. It's all right, mine comes off too. 
the 6th of August 1988, and Con Constantine, I can't pronounce his name. That's okay. Known as, also known as Dapper. I'm going to think of Free Ferta. Oh my. Chelsea is even more amazed than before she claps and cheers loud like Chelsea kisses Steve. Oh, well, how awkward. Chelsea, oh, oh well, if you want to. Wow, wow. <laughs> Shit, yeah. Bloody cool. I'm speechless like. You need a rest now, for goodness sake. I do. I said that by you because it's one of my favourite holiday destinations. I said, 6th of August because that's my birthday and Dapet because I love his music. You know? <laughs> oh my gosh. It's freaked me out a lot. <laughs> He's amazing. <laughs>